everybody, welcome back. It's me playing Peppers, and today, um, well, it's my third video, third one in the series. So, if you've watched the last two, then you probably get it by now. I'm playing Pokemon Black Randomized Nuzlocke, uh, which we got off to a great start since uh, our starter was a Reggie Gigas called Reggie, then we got a throw. Or Squidward and our last encounter we got was uh, Swoop to my Um I healed him up after gym, by, uh, gym fight and thought got to uh, throw so we have someone to you know got the trees because that's the thing we need to do and um, yeah gonna continue now I think we got like two or uh, encounters we're gonna get here um so that's a great start of an episode i think oh okay i guess bianca is also um she wants to join in there's the fun okay <gasps> oh she's seeing something yeah i know it's mana but the question is which one will it actually be Oh, damn it. First we gotta fight off the Team Galactic. No, wait. Team Plasma? What is it? Yeah, Team Plasma. <laughs> hey. Don't you hit that Pokemon. That's not nice. Exactly. Lord. Okay. Well. Ooh, a Gyarados. That's, um... Would be scary if it didn't have Frigic, I guess, you know? Now it's E-C. Not even a word. Oh, trash. Pretty strong with the Oh. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. I do need to make sure I train up the other ones as well, because I don't want Reggie to get double leveled because I'm just using him. So that's why last episode as well I was mainly like leading with the others in switch training since Reggie is obviously the best of my team, but you know. I want to have a well uh, roll around the team and there's not much uh to do about that when I just use one one, you know. See the wind knock off. Side beam. As long as it doesn't confuse me, it shouldn't do too much. Easy. Hey, gets us. And another gets us. And a third gets it. Gets us. And it's gone. Cool. Hey, that's uh, the research lady. Uh, oh, they're leaving. Oh, wait. I thought... Oh, never mind. I thought we uh, were to uh, catch mana as a, like a static here. But I guess that's not the case. Well, at least we're going to get a regular encounter, which is going to be a... Burmy, great. Well, guess our luck had to end at some point, right? Yeah. Yeah, I, I, honestly, mainly catching it for dupes, maybe death water, but hey, no. Oh. And then it does that. At least stay in the ball, you know. I'm gonna. Watch me waste balls on the Burmy. One, two, three, 
and boom. Great. Let's see how are we gonna call this little leafy guy. Uh, let's see. Let's call her because it's a girl. I said guy, I know. Let's call her. I don't. I honestly have no. <laughs> Mia. Great. This is Mia the Burmy. Sometimes inspiration just doesn't come. You know. Let's see. I believe there's an item here. Yeah. Oh, and X Defense. And there's an item back there as well. Is there something here? Another item. Tree mill. Okay. Take those. Let's get the last item as well. A destiny knot. Hmm. Okay, cool. I want to say if we need to evolve a dust skull or dust um, dust clubs into a dust nor if we ever get it, but um, yeah, I. Uh, for the randomizer, I turned on impossible evos, so like trade evolutions, uh, health item evolutions, stuff like that. Those uh, are like remapped to being just a level evolution. So we will, uh, you know, if we get any month like that, I don't know exact ex uh, what level it will be, but probably like in the well, what you would expect in like some range of like other mods that are similar is usually how they do it, I think. Okay. Um, let's swap. I need to train about a month. So I'm gonna put swoop in front next, I think. Back should do much. How much will water gun do? Decent. Water fluid. That's fine. Yeah. Okay, and another thing I am <laughs> way lower energy than um, the last few episodes, which was already kind of low energy. I'm sorry, I am quite tired and I don't know what to talk about. Uh, I still like, I also, I haven't seen maybe um, when I upload this, there have been, but so far I haven't seen comments uh, yet about like things you should talk about or stuff like that or stuff you like, which is fine, like I didn't expect anyone to see my videos yet anyway, so with the few views I did get, I'm happy, I really am, uh, but if even if it's a year later or so, if you're watching this now, um, let me know. What do you think I I should like do in these episodes? Because I'm not going to be like full focused on the game like 24-7. Um, since, I don't know. Ooh. Nugget, that's good for money. And I saw there was an item there I didn't yet get. But yeah, uh... Old Amber, that's a fossil, so that's a free encounter. Um, yeah. So I probably will resort to talking about like movies and uh, movie series, video games, stuff like that. But I don't know if that's something people like. As in, if people like it when I do it, because I know lots of people just talk about random stuff when they playing games and such and people like it but uh, yeah lots of those people are a little bit more um, ent enthusiastic and like uh, charismatic than I am <laughs> so I feel like if I start talking about stuff like that I don't know uh, I don't know if uh, sea gear great nope I don't have time I'm sorry 
Um, I don't know. I don't think I will. I am the most like. Um, what I'm trying to say is, I don't think I will turn this like into a podcast type of thing, where I'm just playing on the background. Since I honestly don't think I'm interesting <laughs> enough for that, which might be a harsh thing to say about yourself, but I don't know. Um, but I do want to like probably just have some topics to talk about in an episode, because like now I notice I'm uh, just rambling about. And hoping to stumble upon something. So I guess I'm going to be a little bit more gameplay focused for now. Which hopefully is fine as well. Let's see. Because I should be able to get my next encounter here right now. Since we are going through route 3. Um, is this an optional battle? Not sure. Oh. But yeah. Swoop and Squidward are going to handle this just fine. Let's see, my first double battle. Oh yeah, triple battles are a thing in this game as well, aren't they? I believe that's where they introduced them in black and white one. Pretty sure. Oh, this is actually a good matchup. <laughs> Alright. Although I don't have... Um, don't fight move just yet. Oh, Quillao has Storm Drain as well. Okay. That's uh, unexpected, to say the least. So I guess the mashup is not as good as I thought. Well. Then we're just gonna attack the opposite of what our typings would suggest, right? Oh, damn it. I forgot again how Storm Drain worked. It actually draws in. I talked about this, I think, in the last episode that, oh yeah, Storm Drain, it uh, draws in water moves, so it's only like good in double battles. Uh, yes. Maybe I should have listened to myself, you know, but, you know, who does that these days, you know? Alright, then Swoop is uh, useless, let's get him back here and uh, hope this cut. Or I should, could have also backed him cut. Uh, taking a ooh. God is not gonna take him out when he's burnt, and also okay. Live, yes, thank you very much. Uh, uh dizzy punch and a swap. Back to swap, because storm drain Quilava will be gone. And honestly, trading a Burmy, I. I might do it like when I have to grind or like have to really get a team together. I might grind Burmy up as well, maybe even off camera. But like to keep on training Burmy when he, he's probably gonna get boxed as soon as I get like better months and I have a full party. I'm not gonna like uh, yeah put effort into that now. Maybe when I need him, you know. Maybe when I faint and he's one of the only ones I have left in my box, then. I'll be happy to take him out and train him up, you know? But for now, not that interested. Time for an encounter. Oh, Sharon, what does he have to say? Oh, he wants a battle, really? I should probably uh, kind of memorize where the uh, rival battles are, since, I don't know, they both have quite good mods. The Matang and the Kyogre, so <laughs> and Matang is gonna be a Madden Gross, and then yeah, it will be a little bit hard to deal with. Watergun still does nothing, and he still does a lot with takedown. Less than last time though, but maybe level difference is other is different. But yeah, I'm just gonna go into Reggie. Rather be safe than sorry, you know. Dizzy punch. For a non-effective move, that's so much. Like, oh, Armberry. Like, 
a stab dizzy punch even even it's just dizzy punch but a stab dizzy punch is like so good on Roger I guess any stab move is like infinitely better imagine when I get like takedown body slam stuff like that I don't know if Reggie Gigas gets it, I also don't know how like the randomizer um, handles level up moves if it follows like strictly what uh, they usually would get or if it's more a thing of um, this might be something he could get so why not since it's a randomizer I'm not 100% sure um, could probably easily look it up since you know they have moves so I could just check is it something they would normally have? So far, I feel like it is, so. But we'll see. Let's finish him off. Easy. Easy does it. Alright. Okay, and then someone is running towards the cave. That's great. Oh, Bianca's coming too. Oh, they stole like her, her Pokemon or something. Yes. We got this. But first... Encounter. Another old Amber. <laughs> nice. I mean, they're gonna randomize to the same one, I guess, so... I mean, I guess one can just be in the PC. And a Gathida. That's my encounter. Okay, cool. Sure. Nothing special, but you know. It's fine. Oh, I thought it said tickle and a uh, tackle, and then I did like another animation was word, but it said tickle. Um, and the rat. Very nice. Let's throw a ball and should be able to catch this pretty easily. Nope. I don't want, let's, how much does it? Oh, there's like two or three, so I can just keep spamming A for now and uh, shouldn't be any problem. All right. Very nice. Cathedra. The rebel like feelers increase psychic powers. Okay. How are we gonna call this ribbon like uh thingy? I mean he also has a bow tie, so how about Bow. Just like that. Bow. This is bow. I believe, if I remember correctly, Sharon uh, heals you here. Yeah. Oh. No. She asks you if you're fine. If not, she just asks you to go heal. Damn it. I thought she healed you. Damn it. And I have to go all the way back. <sighs> I guess first let's stomp this trainer. Because that's how we do. Again, leveling up my Reggie. A bomb. Oh, damn it. Effects for is such an annoying, like... It's cool when it procs and you are the one who has the ability, you know, and... It, but when I get... By uh, effects for poison points, stuff like that, yeah, exactly poison point as well. <laughs> what happens to me, I honestly just get annoyed. 
so I guess they do their job well because they are meant to be annoying ability, I think. But yeah, when used against me, not a fan. All right. Time to run back quick, real quick, can heal. Iron, cool, cool. Okay, no, she doesn't have, okay. I, I could also, also just like, uh, use my potions, although I didn't buy that much, but if possible, I want to save um, money for buying like, well, also Pokeballs since encounters are important. But also like uh, healing items for later on because at some point I'm probably just going to need them in like gyms and definitely in the Elite Four. Since, you know, without healing items that's uh, in general just quite a difficult task so with no luck. Yeah. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's go towards the cave. I don't know what that was. Yeah, I'm ready. I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. But first... Swap. And now I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. Oh, damn. Sorry that late. Munch likes. Um. Did it freeze? I think my game just froze. Let me see. Is it actually frozen? You gotta be kidding me. Well, guys, I'm gonna do a quick cut and uh, I'll see you back when I fix this. Whoop! And we're back. Um, I, I, well, luckily it wasn't that much, but I had to do like um, the stuff we did uh, from the start of the episode until here. Um, I have to replay that. But now we're here. And we still got Bo and Mia, our, um, what's this, what's her, um, Gotha, Gotharida, and Burmy, Gothel, I keep forgetting her name. Anyway, we got them. They are apparently male now instead of female, so now we got two males, Mia and Bo, but that's fine. Um, at least we got them back, and, um. Now he actually sent out a bunch of likes. Like it took a little bit when when they said um, go munch legs or something. So I was scared it was gonna crash again, but it didn't. So luckily we can uh, actually progress. Why is this so, uh, defense girl, she like, only push defense, not special defense, right? Why does water gun do so little? Or did he, or did amnesia, never mind. I'm not paying attention. But I, I want to train up swoop, I don't want to switch, especially not the right jig, I guess, since, you know, I use him way too much already. So, uh, oh, that's annoying. All right, there we go. Oh, 
Ah, a double battle. This time. Ooh, Gorler, Gulag and Ershing. They actually look like quite a cool team. And with Ghost and they are quite a decent team, so... Huh. Uh, I am gonna switch to Squidward. Let's go, Squidward. Damn, my tank got paralyzed. Uh, I could buy focus energy. Like, can't really touch color, so I'll put my sunglasses. Okay. Um, just go for a cut on our shrine. That did uh, nothing. I'm gonna go for the crit. That's cool. Well, at least my tank is doing some work. Oh. I oh crit ah, two crits in a row. Oh. There we almost lost Squidward. If he had one, because it hits two to five times, so luckily it was only three, but two of them were crits, which is kind of insane. Uh, guess I have to go to Reggie after all. That was, uh, you know, a little close for comfort, but we're fine, you know. We got this. Like, Reggie could steamroll through all of this, but I don't want to... Like, only rely on the RG. Probably after this episode, I might just grind up uh, the mons so they're all, like, a similar level. So I can actually use most of them. Maybe I should uh, look at what, like, the gym leader levels are. So I can make sure I don't over level and I like, uh, cause I don't want to make it too easy for myself. But we'll see. But I do get a new counter now, so that's good. Um, and let's see where it is. Can we make a team of six? Ooh, Lapras. That's not bad. Um, don't think a this punch will knock it out, right? Lapras is pretty bulky. Knock off the kid in the red. Easy. And now let's throw Gribble. Ooh, first try. Oh yeah. Welcome to the Team Lapras. So we got a full team of six now. And uh, well, this is... Let's see. All right, um, let's see. Oh. Oh, we could have gotten a size, uh, size method as well, which is pretty cool. But uh, I'm probably gonna go back to like the little dialogue thing and then we're gonna wrap it up because when I checked uh, when I recursed, we were already like 25 minutes in or so, so. Um, First, let's check out Lapras, see what his uh, ability and stuff is. Aftermath. Okay. I mean, not a bad ability, but in a Nuzlocke, not something you want to go for, you know? 
you don't want to have your Pokemon faint, so. But, uh, you know. Well, we got a full team of six now, which is pretty cool, so. Uh, yeah. Thank you so much. Yay. Eel balls. Thank you. The question is now, uh, is this a, no, it's not a new route. Okay. Okay. You know what? Yeah, I can do that. Off. Um, let's see. I'm gonna uh, end the episode here. Then I'm just probably gonna like off screen run to the book center heal and train them all up to like 13 14 someone around that so the whole team is like a little bit balanced but uh this is gonna be it for today i hope you enjoyed if you did please hit the thumbs up and uh, consider subscribing you know it would really help me out and i would appreciate it immensely and yeah that's uh, about all i want to say so see ya